A groundbreaking new study published in the journal PLOS One has revealed the discovery of burial wrappings soaked in embalming agents at a Neolithic grave in Upper Egypt, which shows that ancient Egyptians were experimenting with or practicing mummification at least 1,500 years earlier than previously suggested. According to a news release in Live Science, the burial shrouds had been sitting in England's Bolton Museum for nearly a century after being dug up from the Badari and Mostajeta prehistoric burial grounds in the Nile Valley, which are dated to between 4,500 BC and 3,100 BC. The linens were originally wrapped around a number of well-preserved corpses, but scientists at the time had assumed that the hot, dry desert sand had naturally mummified the corpses. While environmental conditions may have played a part, the new research, which involved a detailed analysis of 50 mummy wrappings, shows that the ancient Egyptians were producing mixtures from animal fats, tree resins, plant extracts, sugar, and natural petroleum, which contained powerful antibacterial elements and had embalming properties. The researchers also found chemical signatures of heating, suggesting these substances had been processed in antiquity. It was a recipe that was relatively consistent across all samples, and it was the same recipe essentially that was being used later in pharaonic, classical Egyptian mummification, said study researcher Stephen Buckley, an archaeological chemist at the University of York in England. If you can preserve the body, you can perhaps cheat death and survive into the next life. That was the late Egyptian mindset, and it seems earlier cultures were already thinking on those sorts of lines, added Buckley. Although the mummies of ancient Egypt are arguably the most famous mummies in the world, they are not the oldest. The Chincharos of South America began artificially preserving their dead about 7,000 years ago, and their mummies have become one of the wonders of Andean archaeology. Buckley noted that most cultures that practiced mummification, including the Egyptians and Chincharos, lived in dry, desert climates where bodies would be preserved naturally to some extent. He suspects people in these regions may have connected natural body preservation with cheating death and may have later developed salves to aid in that process. Egyptologists have previously maintained that mummification started in Egypt around 2600 before Christ, during the era known as the Old Kingdom. However, a number of finds have been turning up evidence that challenges this date. For example, resin-soaked wrappings on bodies dating to the 4th millennium before Christ were discovered at Hierakompolis. However, this is the first study to demonstrate the presence of resin-soaked line centuries earlier than previously believed, and to confirm the composition of the embalming recipes.